All right, y'all. I was uh, tagged by Piedmonte eighty nine to show five things <clears throat> that I would bring me in the event of a zombie attack. Uh, I'll be honest with you. I don't know anything about zombies. Never watched a zombie movie. Um, I don't know if this is all a joke or just kind of a infer uh, in inferring uh, the end of the world times, I guess. Uh, I don't plan on being here when the Shiite hits the fan. I will have long been translated away from the action, but <clears throat> if I am here when it gets started, I was asked to mention five things that I would bring with me. And, um, the first thing that I would bring is my favorite that has been safety checked. Uh, that's my Springfield with the keys grips. I'm going to have that with me. And to all the uh, zombies out there, know full well that I will not hesitate one second to shoot you with that son of a bitch right there. I promise you. <laughs> Another thing that I would bring. I'm not a knife man. Uh, I do not want to be hacked on and cut on. I would much prefer you to take your pistol and put it between my eyes and pull the trigger. Do not hack on me. I, I can't stand it. I don't like paper cuts. So do not hack on me. But in the case of a zombie attack I'm gonna have this with me I'm not gonna cut you with it I'm not gonna hack on you with it but I promise you without hesitation I will put that through your temple till it protrudes from the other side of your head in a nanosecond if you're trying to harm me and my family so that's two the third thing that I would bring with me in the event of a zombie attack now I haven't done a review on this yet But that is my Mini 14. I love that water rifle there because it is so much like an M14. Uh, I know all about it. I know its capabilities. I can knock a gnat off a hot rock with it. And I'm thinking I could readily get the, the uh, ammo for it. The fourth thing that I would bring, those of you that know me, and this may sound silly, but it's important to me, I would have a tuba chapstick. Yeah, I'm going to have chapstick with me 24-7. Summer, fall, winter, spring, I'm going to have chapstick because nothing is more comforting to me than chapstick, especially if I'm fixing to have to kill a bunch of people. And fifth but not last by any means, 
Um, that is a Bible. That is my Bible. I don't always carry that with me, but there is always one with me. I'm not a Bible thumper. I don't quote scriptures, but I find great comfort in what is in between these pages. And a little known fact, and you can check it out, it's factual. All of you are probably familiar with the father of bluegrass, uh, Bill Monroe. Uh, not many years before his death, uh, he was arrested for beating his wife in the head with his Bible. So I never looked at it as a weapon in that regard, but um, a good Bible, I'm thinking I could whack a few of these uh, zombies upside the head with this and it would inflict some damage if not damage maybe I could knock a little sense into their head and for real torture if I was wanting to torture them I could sit down and just start reading to them and since they are ungodly and an unholy and a group of people and reprobates I would imagine it would be pure hell, pardon the pun, for me to sit down and slowly read from Genesis through Revelation. So, those are the five things that I would bring with me in the order that I would bring them. And, uh, course as a footnote to all those zombies out there I'll be easy to find because I'll be wearing my Armory Channel t-shirt you'll be able to find me I'll stand out in the crowd which also shows you that I'd have a little bit of class in the final days now I'm supposed to tag someone else I hate like hell doing it but um, I'm thinking of someone who's got all kinds of stuff. Everything from a gas mask to nail clippers. And it'd probably be interesting to see what they would bring with, him, with them. And so I'm going to tag Misty223. Let's see what you would bring. And um, if you don't mind, since I'm going to probably be out there amongst the living, uh, bring along a jar that uh, jarred chicken you got. And uh, at least we'll have a great final meal we could have some chicken salad sandwiches or something but anyway those are the five items that I would bring with me at this moment now if something better comes along I'm sure that uh, I could adjust this but that's what I would bring and I appreciate y'all watching bye